Hi everybody, Kenneth G. Hasty here once again. Today's video is called Gone Away. Gone Away. What do I mean by that? Well, simply this. In business and in sales, or if you own a company, you know, customers go away. And sometimes you don't really know why. We tend to take our customers for granted, right? We're always out looking for new customers. But what about the old customers, right? And uh, today I had an experience that was kind of close to home for me. I uh, had to do with going to the dentist. How many of you like going to the dentist? I know, right? So, and I know a lot of people watching this are dentists. I have uh, many friends from that are dentists from uh, my years in the dental industry in the past. But uh, I'm still involved in the dental industry with my clients, but in a different world. But uh, this video, I don't want to ramble too much about that. But I, I did a video a while back about my $6,500 tooth. And this is kind of a sequel to that. and and what I mean by that is this. I've, I've gone to the same dentist for quite a while. They had a pretty good reputation. Um, you know, but it, it was getting harder and harder as, as, a, as a patient. You know, it's harder to get in. You know, um, you know, I always paid my bill. It wasn't anything like they were trying to keep me from getting in, right? But, um, you know, it was harder to get in. I needed like two, three, four weeks notice to get in the door. And then, you know, um, it used to be a really friendly environment. And then this dentist took this kind of... Uh, um, they brought in some kind of efficiency expert, business consultant, whatever, and all of a sudden it was all about the money, 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 and fast, fast, fast. And um, after a while, I, you know, I just kind of got caught up in the wash. And, I, and what, what, what put me over the edge, I think, was when uh, I, I had one tooth that was acting up and it, it had got an infection uh, and it needed uh, root canal and all this kind of stuff, or maybe just take it out, put an implant in. Hard to say, right? So, so the net net is. You know, I, I, I spent uh, with them all together, what's see, thousand, couple thousand, you know, with, with the, you know, you know, things that were done, maybe twenty five hundred, three thousand dollars I don't know what it is a lot on one for on one tooth. And that's before they gave me the quote to wrap it all up for six thousand five hundred dollars more, of which they wanted ten percent down right now on the spot with their high pressure sales tactics. And and I just kinda took a break. I thought, you know, that kinda put me over the edge. So I told you that to tell you this. I've been putting it off for a while. I thought, maybe I'll just go to a different dentist, you know. And I, so I found one in town here, and I thought, I thought, well, I'll call, you know, I, maybe I can get in in July or whatever. And they said, yes, we can get you in tomorrow morning. I'm, I'm like, what? You know, yeah, tomorrow morning we'll, we can get you in, no problem. I'm like, all right, sure. You know, it's a bigger operation. You know, they got several dentists there. And I said, all right, I'll check it out. So I go in there, and, you know, I, the experience was wonderful. That people were friendly. Um, they listened to ex what my needs were, exactly what I said. Um, and I walked out of there with my, 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 my expensive tooth taken care of for a few hundred bucks, and all was good. So it got me thinking about business in general is how often do we just kind of take our customers for granted? And then, then they eventually go away. They don't say anything. They just kind of had enough, you know? Um, little things like, when I remember when I was a kid, I used to watch this TV show, and I loved it. It was called The Equalizer. And it was uh, um, it would come on, and, 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 and then, you know, you'd go to watch it the night it was on, and, oh, they had a special on that night. you go to watch it again, and, then, oh, we moved it to a different night. And then you go, after a while, you just give up trying to find the show because they're, they're so busy trying to get a new audience that they lose the main audience that uh, is watching it, so therefore put it out of business because the audience is essentially the customer, right? So if you've got clients, you've got customers, especially regular or bigger ones, um, I highly suggest not taking them for granted, but reaching out, checking with them, seeing how things are going, you know, just sincerely, especially, you know, if you've got any kind of a, a service business, it's not, you're not just selling bubble gum or something, but, you know, checking with your clients, make, make sure that your business is going as smoothly as you think it is, and you will... Um, you will find that you'll keep from losing a lot of clients. You know, I took, you know, I'm one of the guys they used to bring in just to turn companies around with their sales. And I remember one I came in and we had a 30% loss rate of customers. And it was like, you know, when I walked in the door, we had a lot less after I walked in the door. But, you know, I'm like, hey, we're losing our own customers. You know, it's hard enough to get new customers, but I, I you know, I'm not going to make that. I have to sell 50% more to get to get 20 because we're losing 30. So let's get out there. Let's, let's stop losing the 30. We did a great job of that. We did a revitalization campaign. I won't bore you with all that. But anyway, I just wanted to share that with you. Don't take your customers for granted or your clients for granted. And um, 
you know, we're this is like I said, it's all I'll say for now. I'm running out of time. So this is Kenneth G. Hasty, um, a professional business growth consultant. You know, I'm the guy you call when you get serious about growing your business. You know, when when you want to work uh, on your business and uh, let us work in your business, do the things that you do really well and let us do the things we do really well, which is the sales, the marketing, the systems, you know, CRMs, all that kind of stuff. And we can come alongside you. Think of it like a jigsaw puzzle, right? And so you've got this company, you got this. We just kind of come in and mold to that side of that jigsaw puzzle, make an up arrow out of it, and then we help you grow your business. So if you want to talk about that, I'll, I'll put a link in here. You can give me a call at your leisure. It might be in the comments section. Otherwise, if you want to check me out, it's Kenneth G. Hasty at Kenneth G. Hasty. Well, KennethGHasty.com or Kenneth at KennethGHasty.com. So anyway, that's all I got to say for that. Don't take your customers for granted. Um, what I call this video was uh, gone away, I think, right? It's gone away. Bye. <laughs> I'm going away. Talk to you later. Thanks. Bye.